we lucked out in that literally a new, you know, a new head of stars came in and in an interview, he mentioned liking Party Down and Rob Thomas just called him on the phone the next day and was just like, we're available. <laughs> Party Down season three, man. Uh, uh, gosh. Who'd have thought? <laughs> right? <laughs> I remember watching the show back when it was on and I was one of the fans who was, you know, bummed to see it go, but I'm super excited it's back. Uh I imagine a lot went into making this happen. Um, a, I mean, a lot did, absolutely. But also, it was just one of those things where, you know, we because we've been trying and trying sort of on and off for years and years because we never, you know, we never lost our affection for the show and our belief that at the drop of a hat, we could just run off and start doing it again. So we, you know, we were just looking for the opportunity. And, um, you know, we... We lucked out in that literally a new, you know, a new head of stars came in and in an interview, he mentioned liking Party Down and Rob Thomas just called him on the phone the next day and was just like, we're available (laughs) anytime. (laughs) And, you know, it literally went from there. So it was, you know, a, a stroke of great good fortune. So and we weren't about to, like, you know, look away. So, you know, and fortunately, you know, our our cast and everybody is, you know, they're all share our affection for the show and everything. So when we, we just emailed everybody and we're like, look, we might be able to make this happen. What do you say? Um, And, you know, sadly, you know, Lizzie was unavailable due to scheduling conflicts, but everybody else we were able to squish in there. So that part, you know, amazingly kind of fell together very neatly. And then the hard work of actually producing the show in the middle of a COVID spike, with a bunch of actors who were definitely much more famous than they were when we started out. Um, you know, every every time somebody sneezed, you know, we lost a day here or there with somebody. So that that part was tricky, but, you know, I didn't have to do that. So <laughs> for, you know, Dan Etheridge, our producer and our line producer spent a lot of time doing that juggling or whatever. So they definitely, you know, earned their fee. Um, and uh, I just kind of rewrote when somebody couldn't make it. Or whatever. <laughs> but otherwise, yeah, it was, you know, everything else was great. So we, and, you know, as I said, we were just very happy to be there. That's awesome. One one of the things I feel like I picked up on, and, and you could correct me if, if maybe this wasn't the approach, but the, the revival season, or sequel season, however you want to say it, just new season, feels a bit like satire of revivals. Like you Uh use this as an opportunity to kind of like poke a little bit. We did because, you know, it's certainly something that has changed in the time that we went from, you know, 12 years ago to now. And, you know, we wanted to try and, you know, be a little, you know, winkingly self-conscious about that certainly but because we didn't you know we in our minds we were just continuing the story and they were just like all right it's 12 years later go and so we didn't we never thought about it as a reboot or a reunion or a kind of nostalgia you know event or anything like that we just were like okay we get to keep doing it start um (laughs) so that was kind of our attitude coming in so we definitely i think play a little of that you know in the pilot where we kind of see everybody getting back together um and you know that was kind of took the most effort was to try and figure out how to have people who have kind of moved in different directions in their lives as happens and try and get them all together um and then go from there so once we kind of got that figured out you know everything flowed pretty well Wonderful. Well, that that first episode really like uh, uh, was a real um, twist for me. I, you, <laughs> kind of, I was like, oh, OK. And and then we're off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, we only had six episodes. You know, we, we used to do 10 and this time we got six. So we really had to kind of step on the gas from the get go. Well, it's awesome. It knocks it out of the park. John, thank you so much for taking time to chat today. I oh, really thanks so much.